was an icon to his fellow workers, his fellow uh, aircraft designers, and to those of us who never got a chance to meet him, but heard stories about him. I think Alexander Cotvelli was not only one of the greatest of American aircraft designers, I think he was one of the greatest of world aircraft designers. He, along with Clarence Kelly Johnson, represent two perhaps of the best known and greatest of the designers of military aircraft. His interests even extended to space flight. And in the 1960s, he was looking very much at developing practical, reusable spacecraft that could take off from the Earth, fly into orbit, and return to Earth with much greater utility even than the space shuttle today. Alexander Cotvelli to us typifies the American spirit. He was an individual who was very proud of his, his uh, background. He was very uh, fiercely proud of being Georgian. And he came to this country and gave to us the strength and tenacity and the purpose and the will that we associate with the people of Georgia. And he added that to what we were. And he made us a better nation. And so I think it's very important for us in this country to remember Cotvelli as really exemplifying in many ways what we would call the American dream. Well, his contribution to air dominance for the United States uh, was extremely significant. And assuming that we have an F-105 available and we don't have other plans for it, it just seems to me that it would be a wonderful tribute to him and to Georgia uh, for us to contribute that plane to Georgia. Uh, and, 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 you know, if nothing else, as a reminder of the special relationship that has existed between our countries for really quite some time, uh, and, and a relationship that's very important to both those countries right now.